Greetings, light bodies, reflecting the divine. So here's some ball slapping that needs to be done, followed by peaceful non-compliance, of course, for sure. When you watch a movie again after 10 years in this matter, you realize how much has changed in the awareness of being aware, your consciousness. So in case you haven't heard about this movie, or were not aware of it at that time, or just want to see it again, or thinking you're living on a spinning ball, whatever, let's watch carefully. Ready, steady, go. The divine force awakens, and it's calling to you. Just let it in. So, uh, what's the action? I just pulled a soldier demon out of a little girl. Looked like he was trying to come through. Yeah, I know how it sounds. Now, we're finger puppets to them, John, not doorways. Well, they can work us, but they can't come through onto our plane. A demon just attacked me right out in the open on Figueroa. They don't like you, John. How many have you deported back to hell? Not some angry half-breed midnight, a full-fledged demon here on our plane. But when you cross over, time stops. Take it from me, two minutes of hell is a lifetime. When I came back, I knew. All the things I could see were real. Heaven and hell were right here. Behind every wall, every window. The world behind the world. And we're smack in the middle. Angels and demons can't cross over onto our plane. Yeah. My mom would be the last demon with everyone crossing over to our plane. Yeah, so much for the ball. You were never real. So one, two, three, four. You're out. Goodbye, you sexy motherfucker. No more illusions. Can you keep my secret? Can you? Because here's one for you. Hell is what we're experiencing. The unknowing, the fear, the disequilibrium, the pain, the suffering. All of that is, we're living in hell. And that heaven is realizing that, that which is going through all of that, is not who we are. Inherent in form is suffering. So as long as you are in form, you will suffer. But if you realize that what you are is not in form, then there is suffering, but you're not having it. And so the suffering that exists, that we call life, is hell. And the soul that doesn't have that, but is observing it and witnessing it, is heaven. So heaven and hell are two ends of the same spectrum that are a part of the polarity of what is here. Both exist simultaneously. Yet hell is an illusion because it only exists in the mind. Only in the mind. Only in the mind, lovely people. <laughs>